In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect the G502 wireless to Mac. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. The G502 can be used wirelessly as long as you have a model that allows you to do so using the wireless receiver. Keep in mind that no G502 model supports Bluetooth. So while you will be able to use it wirelessly, you will need an available USB port. You cannot do it over Bluetooth. So, most wireless models will include the Lightspeed receiver. All that you have to do is set it up so you can connect the receiver to the actual dongle, and by using the provided USB-C to USB-A cable, you can either connect the mouse directly to the Mac, so plug one end of the USB-A to USB-C cable into the Mac and another one into the mouse. This will allow you to charge the mouse or use it wired. If you want to use it wirelessly, just plug the USB-C end of the USB-A to USB-C cable into the dongle that has the wireless receiver connected into it. Once you have the dongle set up with the wireless receiver, look at the bottom of the mouse, you will be able to power it on by setting the toggle to the on position, and once this is done, it will automatically pair itself up with the wireless receiver. Now, you will be able to use your G502 on your Mac. You can go over to the official Logitech website and download G-Hub for macOS, and once this is done, you will be able to change a bunch of settings about the mouse. So, for example, I have the G502X Lightspeed, and as you can see, I'm able to change the sensitivity, do assignments, and I'll be able to see the battery levels. You can keep the firmware up to date, so click on the settings option, and you will be able to see the latest firmware available for your specific G502 model. As long as you have a light speed model, it is going to include the wireless receiver that you can use. If your mouse is low on battery, you will be able to charge it by unplugging the cable from the receiver and plugging it directly into the mouse instead. You can still completely use your mouse while it is charging and it is going to be compatible with any Mac device. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect G502 wireless to Mac. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching!